really busy with work and stuff, but I decided that today it would be easier for me, instead of doing a sit down video, I would bring you guys along with me. So right now I am just getting ready. I am going to get my eyelashes redone. Um, this is what they look like now. Um, they look okay, but they definitely need to get done. I can't wait. Two weeks um, usually is like the longest I can go without getting them done, but she's gonna try new glue and lashes on me today. So she said maybe I would be able to go three weeks to four weeks, which would be really nice. But um, I actually go to a place that's around 20 minutes away from my house. So I usually have to leave a little bit early because there's always a lot of beach traffic and stuff, especially in the summer. So yeah, right now I am just getting ready. Ollie just came over to say hi to you guys. <laughs> Too bad he can't come with me, right? So right now I just have a roller in my hair because um, I have really um, fine hair and I like a lot of volume. So I usually try to put rollers in my hair if um, I didn't wash my hair that day. So that's what I'm doing right now just to give myself a little bit of volume. He's like bugging. <laughs> He's so cute. Mm. I don't know if you guys saw him with his new haircut. I think I showed you guys, but I'm not sure. But I just shaved him for the summer. He looks super cute, which is a big plus. So I have my coffee right here and all of my rollers and I'm just going through and I'm gonna put them all up and I will show you um, when I'm done. So this is what it looks like when I'm all done. Uh, I just kind of do a mohawk and then I just do the side. So it just gives me volume all around the top and then I spray it and then I just let it sit while I'm doing my makeup. Um, on my channel, I usually like never talk about what makeup I use. Like it's kind of rare, but um, if you guys are interested in that, I could always like do like a get ready with me. I definitely don't want to do tutorials because I don't really like know how to do like makeup that well. I mean, I know how to do it on myself, which I feel like everybody does, but I don't know if I would be good at explaining it to you guys to like how to do it for yourself. So, but I will show you a few of my favorite products um, if you guys are interested. If not, you can just fast forward. Um, I, my number one like holy grail concealer, like I don't know what I would do without, is um, this one. I think it's by, oh, I don't know, and it just has a D on it. I think it's like, I got it at Ulta. But I think it's called like Dermatology or like something like that. But it's in the color natural. I'll actually just link it below. That would be way easier than me like waiting for four hours trying to figure out what it's called. But it's basically just um, comes up and it's like a uh, kind of looks like a lipstick. And I, oh my god, I love it so much. So I usually, let me just grab my mirror. I usually just do it in the, like, the places that I need it the most. So I'll do a little bit under my eyes just to brighten up a little bit. And then I usually do down my nose just because I usually get a lot of redness down my nose. And then like I'll do it on like spots that I have. Like I have a few, um, not breakouts, but uh, like I want to say scars, more like scars. And then I just do it above my lip a little bit because I get sunspots above my lip, which sucks. Oh, worst thing ever. So then I just like take my foundation brush. Um, sometimes if I'm going out at night and I want a lot more coverage, I will use, oh, I will use my Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer. Um, fortunately, I don't have really bad skin, so I don't need like a heavy, um, can, a heavy foundation. So this usually does a trick, especially if I'm putting the concealer underneath and like covering my face with it. But um, if I'm just like going out quick and like I don't really care what I look like, I'll just throw th some of this on because I feel like it just protects my skin a little bit. And I love the way it feels on my skin because I'm so fussy with stuff like that. So I'm just going to go ahead and um, blend all this. It like blends so well. And it has like a little bit of moisture in it. So like I feel like... If you have really dry skin, it won't look super cakey on you, which is really nice because sometimes my skin will get dry even in the summer. Um, and I don't usually put like cream on my face. <laughs> like sometimes I do. But then after I do that, I will take my um, Max, Max, 
my MAC Fix Plus and I'll just spray it like all over and then let that sit. And then while I'm letting that sit, I will go in and do my eyebrows. Like I said, like I just kind of do things my way. Um, I don't know, like, I don't know. I just do it the way I like to. <laughs> so I kind of just fill it in a little bit. I'm not like too fussy. I just like to like, I just like my eyebrows to like look like a little thicker. Like, if, I don't know if you can tell the difference. So that is that. Um, obviously, it's like a shade lighter than, or like maybe like two shades lighter than my hair. Um, but that is because I dye my hair black. Um, I want to dye my eyebrows, but I don't know. I'm afraid it's going to look stupid and I'm going to look like an idiot. So I'd rather just not like play around with it too much. So now I feel like um, the, the Max Fix Plus has dried. So I am going to go in with... Um, my bronzer and I have two bronzers that I love um one is a little high end and then one is five dollars um the five dollar one is my favorite believe it or not um it's from H&M and it's called the bronzing powder and I am so obsessed with it I feel like the quality is ridiculous they could charge like fifteen dollars and like instead of five and like I'd probably pay up to forty for it and then I love my um MAC bronzer and this is in uh give me sun I don't know if this one, oh, this one's in Gorgeous Tan, the H&M um, one. So uh, today I'm probably going to use my H&M one just because I, I love it so much. Um, and I don't really like contour like too much. Like I try to, but I'm not very good at it. So I like, um, I just like to like, you know, chisel a little bit and then that's about it. I feel like with makeup, like during the day especially, less is more. I like it to look like I don't have any makeup. It just looks like I have really great skin. Um, so that's what I like to do. Then I, um, after I do that, I always go in with like one another Holy Grail product of mine. And this is my Hourglass, um, the lightning powders. Um, and this one, the ambient light lightning powders and this one is in diffused light there you go um so I usually just take a little bit it's such a pretty color oh sorry I'm like oh, there I am but um and then I usually just do it right here just once again to like brighten up a little bit more and then I will do a little bit down my nose and then right here and then that's like kind of it. Like, I don't know if it looks like I did anything, but like in person, it looks like a lot better. I just like more, I look more put together. Um, so then today, oops, um, for lips, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do. I mean, I'll show you guys really quickly. Like this is what my makeup thing I have going on here. Um, but I think... These are all my lipsticks. I don't know. I kind of want something like a little more. Let me just flip it. I kind of want something like a little more natural looking. Um, I did order on Nordstrom. It's supposed to come in today. I ordered the Tom Ford um, lipstick in Skinny Dip. And I saw it on um, Trisha Peta's YouTube channel. And she like just posted a video with it. And I saw it on her and it looked gorgeous. So I immediately bought it, and it's supposed to come in today, which I'm super excited about, but I don't have it right now. So I think I might just, I might just throw on some lipstick and call it a day. Um, yeah, I think I'm just going to do my, um, my, ugh, my Dior, sorry, I'm like brain fog, right? It's still early in the morning. Um, it's in my Dior, and it's the Lip Maximizer, and it is in 001, and that, I don't know, it's probably not going to focus. Yeah, it's not going to focus, um, but I will try to link that below, too, if you guys want to check that out. Um, oh my gosh, this is like eight minutes of me doing makeup. It's kind of ridiculous. So then I just put this on, 
and yeah that is about it it's like uh so that's it i mean that's kind of all i do for my makeup um yeah i was just checking my instagram <laughs> I just, um, I posted a picture of my new bag. Da -da -da. So cute. Once again, I got it from Bag Boys NYC. Um, so, yep. And then I have my little monster on there. And then another keychain. Okay, so you guys know I love my Fendi monsters. But another keychain I've been loving, like completely obsessed with, is my Stella McCartney um, keychain. And it just says Stella on it. I... I'm so obsessed with it. I like, oh, I wish she had more like colors. I love it. Like, and I didn't think I'd like it as much. And when I first got it, I was gonna return it, but then I'm so happy I didn't because I love it. So now that I let my hair like sit for a couple minutes, I'm just gonna take it out and just kind of play with it a little bit. And it kind of looks funny after I first take it out, but then I just like kind of fool around with it and it looks normal. I like like big hair. I don't, I like like very like voluminous hair. So the rollers definitely help me with that. And then that is it. That's like my morning routine. So I think um, I just killed the ozone layer with the hairspray, but that's okay. Um, I literally, I think it takes me about 15 minutes to get ready, which is kind of nice. Um, I don't like to do too much, and especially with the eyelashes, I don't really have to do anything with my eyes. Um, sometimes I will put a little bit of shadow, eyeshadow on my eyes, and I've been loving um, this one. It's actually, like I think it's a couple bucks from Sephora, and it is um, California Blonde number 10, and this is what it looks like, and I'll just like, I'll do it today just for kicks. See, it just brightens up a little bit. Actually, I should have done that. Uh, uh, usually, I would use a brush, but I already have had it on my hand. So, yeah, that is my look. So, um, now I am just going to go um, get dressed, and then I will check back with you guys. Okay, I'm back. So I just changed. I'm wearing um, leggings and I just have this cute little top on. It's by Wild Fox and it says, we still play with Barbies. And then I also have this cute little sweater that I got at um, H&M. I think it was like on clearance. It's super fuzzy. Uh, it's so cute. Um, I'll just show you it on super quick. I usually just bring this because they always have the air conditioning on and it's super freezing. So... That's it, and then I know, like I'm kind of dressing really casual, but I did want to wear uh, heels because I always wear heels. Um, so I think I'm just going to wear like my favorite shoes ever, which I wish I had bought like three pairs, like just to have spares. But they're these. Um, they kind of look like like sporty, so I think that's why I'm going to wear them. But they are by Donald J. Pliner. I think they're from like a year and a half ago or something. So I officially put the shoes on. These are them. They're just super cute, quick, easy. This is it. This is my bag. I'm super obsessed with it. Like I said, I got it from Bag Boys NYC. Um, their website will be linked below and their Instagram. And then I also have my Fendi Monster, my Stella keychain. And another thing I wanted to show you guys is my water bottle. Um, I've been using this so much lately. Uh, it's by Swell. And this is in like the Blanc Crocodile. So I love this color because I feel like it goes with everything. But um, it helps me drink water and I love it. So I will also link their website below. And you guys can check them out. And yeah, so I am probably going to be late. So I should probably run off now. So I'll check back with you guys um, when I'm in the car. and stuck in traffic a little bit with what we are on our way now I am with my mom and yeah so we are just on our way to Westerly it's probably we probably have about 15 minutes to go um, and yeah I think we're going to probably go to TJ Maxx 
a boutique. Are you going to get Dave's Coffee? Or? Dave's Coffee, which is a really cool coffee place, and then I kind of want to get a smoothie. So, um, or like a juice. So, yeah, uh, we will check back with you guys um, when we get there. So, I got this um, juice, and this is a beet, parsley, carrot, and what is the other one? Radish. And then I also got an iced coffee with soy. And then we got two things of coffee. One is Dave's um, coffee, and then the other one's the same thing as decaf. My mom got the same thing as me. And then she also got, what is that, quinoa with what? Carrot, zucchini, celery. So we're just gonna finish this, and then I think we're gonna head out and go shopping, and then probably just head back to the house. Hey guys, so I'm back. Um, sorry I didn't film that much more when I was out with my mom. Um, I just ended up getting distracted and then I got tired, so. Uh, yeah. So anyways, I ended up getting one thing while we were out. Um, and then, like I had said earlier in this vlog, I, um, had my lipstick from Tom Ford coming in and then I also got a pair of shoes. <laughs> So I'm going to just show you everything really quickly. Um, the first thing I got was a pair of Birkenstocks. Um, I kind of wanted them just for like around the house and, um, you know, just like on like more casual days. And I ended up getting the white ones. Um, this is leather. The only thing I'm a little worried about is this isn't black. It's white. Um, I like the way it looks better, but I'm afraid that I'm going to end up getting it dirty. So we'll see. But these are them. They're super cute. Hopefully, I can break them in pretty quickly. And they, like, because when I tried them on at the store, they were, like, pretty uncomfortable. But I have had these before when I was younger, and I liked them. So I ended up buying those at a little um, shoe store right next to where I get my eyelashes done. Um, so that was the first thing. Then um, from Nordstrom's, I ended up getting another pair of shoes. And this is the box it comes in, and it says if the shoe fits. So these are from Jeffrey Campbell, and I'm not sure if I'm going to love them or not. I did love the way they looked, but I haven't tried them on, and I'm not sure if I got my right size. So we'll see. But these just were, like, were very, like, um, uh, like kind of hippie-ish to me, and I loved them. Oh, my gosh, they're really heavy, though. That'll be interesting. But these are them. <laughs> They are so cute. Like, I'm really obsessed with them. Um, I just don't know if I'll really be able to walk in them. But I'm going to try them on, and I will let you guys know. Um, peel this off. Uh, fortunately, Zappos, I'm not Zappos. Um, Nordstrom does free returns. So if I end up not liking them, I can just send them back really quickly. But these are them. Um, I will probably show you guys a picture after I try them on. I'm just wondering how high these are. Because they look freaking huge but we'll see so I ended up getting these and then I ended up getting a few samples um, from Nordstrom's uh, because I guess when you order like beauty products there they let you have samples so I just ended up getting um, three of them um, one of them is just the Dolce & Gabbana perfume in light blue which I already have but I just kind of wanted like a little travel size one and then I got this molten brown um, orange and bergamot body wash so that's just a trial size which I probably will save for when I um go away for weekend trips and stuff like that and then I ended up getting this Trish McAvoy um it's retinol eye cream and it's repair smooth firm brighten and defend it's a beauty booster advanced repair so I ended up getting that um it says apply am and pm to clean dry skin so, we'll see. I mean, I'm not too good at, like, doing beauty regimens because, I don't know, I just end up forgetting. So, I don't know. I'll try it out. And then, here's the lipstick I was telling you guys about. Um, like I said before, it's Tom Ford. It's number 9, and the color is called Skinny Dip. I love the packaging on this, and if I end up liking it, I'm probably going to grab another one because it is limited edition. But, this is what it looks like. Um... It kind of just looks like a pretty, like, a light, dark coral. That makes no sense. A darker coral.
Oh, that's super pretty. You probably can't tell, but it's actually um, really moisturizing, which I'm pretty surprised about because I hate lipsticks that are like, I don't know, it feels like you're putting chalk on your face. I hate that. Um, so right now I just have my little ginger rail. I am probably going to clean because my room's disgusting. And yeah, then I'm just going to, I'm going to lay low tonight. Um, I think this weekend, which I might continue the vlog to the weekend. Um, this weekend I'm going to the club tomorrow um, at Mohegan Sun. And I am just going with a couple of my friends. So I will probably like film a little bit with them. And yeah, then I'm not sure. I think we're doing brunch the next day. And then tomorrow I'm also getting a pedicure. So I don't know if I'm going to continue the vlog or not. Um, so I guess we'll just find out. But yeah, so I am just going to clean up and relax a little bit because I'm tired. <laughs> hey guys, so um, I actually... Just woke up a little while ago and I am just switching my bags right now and getting ready for the day. I have to vacuum really quick before I leave. But I'm actually getting ready to go tanning and then I'm going to head to head to Sephora to go get a makeover. Um, it's I want her to... Uh, what are you doing? I want her to um, cover up... I have like um, some sunspots so I want her to try to cover up those and... <laughs> Sorry, Ollie's being so weird. And then I um, wanted her to just show me how to do my eyes a little bit. Um, so yeah, right now I am just switching my bags. Um, this is the one I used yesterday. It's my um, Chanel camera case. I will try and remember to list the style number below. And that is from the, I think it's from the Cruise uh, 2015 collection. But this is what I'm switching over to, which is my Orange Chanel Mini. Um, this is from the 2014 Spring Summer Collection. I had posted that on Insta. So I am just switching over. Um, the nice thing about the this Mini is I can actually use my uh, wallet with it, which I always just feel better when I have a wallet rather than my cards just hanging around, even though I end up just throwing them in my bag anyways but yes so I am going to switch everything over I have like all this stuff in here that I don't even know what it's for okay so yeah but anyways um tonight I'm actually I think I mentioned last night I'm actually going out with a bunch of friends so that should be fun um I'm not a huge club person but I like, like to go when everyone else goes, I mean, because I like to hang out with everyone and catch up, and it's just, it can be fun. I think it's just, like, now that I'm getting older, like, I don't like it as much, but, oh well. So, I will just show you, like, kind of quickly what you can fit in here, like, in case anyone's thinking about getting the mini. Um, this is just a pack of gum. I just put my, um, Louis Vuitton, uh, pouch in there and then I have a YSL lipstick and this is in or oh, it's a lip gloss it's um tint and oil and this is in number four it's just a really pretty um I'll put a little bit on it looks hot pink but it's not kind of just like a light pink uh just gives it like a little bit of shine it's really cute and then I can fit my phone in here obviously um and so that's kind of it. Like, I'll probably throw my Tom Ford lipstick in here and probably my Marc Jacobs uh, brightening powder. And, yeah, that's about it. So then everything fits in it, and I love it. It's so bright and perfect for summer. And then I will transfer my keychains over because I have my car keys on here. And that would really stink if I didn't have those on me. So yeah, um, this is what it's going to look like. Hold on one second. So it's super like bright. It's like, oh my gosh, it's so bright, but I love it. I love that combo. Like I love that like intense brightness. <laughs> Like it's good. <laughs>